Hey guys, Sturdy Track Gaming here. So today's uh, UFC 2 tutorial will be uh, focused on the clinch and uh, all the types of moves that you can uh, perform whilst you're in the clinch with your opponent. Uh, so the moves that you can do can range from um, uh, punching them in the clinch, uh, trying to get transitions into uh, get better positions to punch them. Um, you can't click kick in the clinch, so it's mainly just punching. Uh, you can get all different types of positions to uh, a really tight clinch where it's, uh, the punches you throw won't be as harmful to your opponent, whereas moving into different positions will leave their head more exposed. Um, so you can be throwing some vicious uh, punches or elbows. Um, other things you can do include uh, moving into different positions to take down your opponent. Um, so I'll be going into that into detail and uh, showing you how that's done. Hope you enjoy it. So here with John Jones and uh, Chael Sonnen. Um, uh, I'll try and get an early clinch, um, but sometimes that's not possible because uh, when you want to clinch, generally your opponent needs to be have a little bit of damage towards them. So I'll just look at softening them up a little bit, then I'll look to initiate a clinch. So to do the clinch, you'll just uh, flick the... Flick the right stick towards your opponent, so I've just done that there, and then you have a, a range of those, so to go towards them, uh, you'll move the right trigger up to break, uh, X and Y to punch there like that, um, so try and clinch there, so you've got the over under, which is this grip, um, the single collar, which is back to here, which is how you initiate, uh, the tie clinch, which is very useful. So you can do punches to the head, which is just vicious like that. Uh, a double under like that. Um, back clinch here like this. Um, it's probably escaping, so we'll go to double under again. Um, go to the back clinch again. So, so what we've got from here is back sitting. So I'll jump on his back. Uh, and from here, uh, this is obviously bottom. We don't want to be on the bottom in the clinch. So I'll look to just get back up. Oh, no. He's doing well on the ground because he is a wrestler. Try and get up, Mr. Jones. There we are. And so in the clinch, they're the basic uh, transitions and things like that. So that's just by moving the uh, right stick. So uh, another thing to do when you're in the clinch is when you're in certain positions to hold the LT button. So I'll try and clinch here. No, I won't. I'll try and clinch here. If I press LT, I can do a leg grab. Uh, he's smashing me at the moment, so I'll try and get out of that. So we get out of that. So if I press LT here, I can do a single leg takedown or a double leg takedown. That's by pressing uh, LT in the uh, single collar position. So, And there, takedown, so you can do a takedown like that, which is very useful for ground and pound and various things like that. So I want to posture up and just... Uh, no, I don't. I just want to get back up. Um, so some fighters, when they're in the clinch, they can use uh, uh, different types of submissions. I'm not sure if Jones can, so I'll just get in the clinch here. Um, I'll look for an over-under. Uh, anything's nothing there like that. Over-under. Double-under. Yeah. So at the moment, uh, John Jones can't do any um, submissions from the clinch. But uh, some uh, fighters, like I was saying, uh, can actually perform flying submissions. So what that means is when you're in the clinch, you can actually um, press LT, hold LT down, and then move the right stick into um, a submission move. Um, and uh, that looks extremely cool. So you'll literally see your fighter just going from the clinch and jumping onto your uh, opponent's body and... So, uh, trying to submit them with a flying ar arm bar or a, if you're on the back a flying rear naked choke things like that and they're extremely cool to see so uh, back to the clinch again so here can do all those things pressing LT is a bit of a leg grab didn't work there so the clinch is a, a very useful tool when you're fighting uh, it allows you to control your opponent whilst you're standing um, and you can either punch them in the clinch whilst you're standing or you can uh, take them down if you're um, fighter is more of a, 
a ground and pound or a grappler or a submission specialist. So hope this has uh, been helpful to you guys. Uh, look forward to the next tutorial. Cheers.